West Hobbies RC. So today we are back with the Blade Fusion 270. Have not flown this helicopter in a couple months probably, a month or two, maybe two months, since the last video I posted on it. It's been sitting on the shelf. It is such a beautiful day out today. Clear skies, little, little bit of wind, but nothing bad. So I figured let's charge up a pack and blow the dust off this model. So again, it's a bone stock 270 other than an Icon fly barless unit. Stock 3050 servo, stock motor, ESC, running a single DSMX satellite and a roaring top 4S 1300 milliamp LiPo 70C. D of course, DX9 radio. So we are going to spool up and see how it still flies. Normal mode. thing flies so good it has probably become my favorite 250 280 size helicopter the icon it really woke it up that was the only thing this helicopter was lacking it was a good fly barless unit. Put it into high head speed. I know a lot of people hate this thing, but I think it flies pretty good. With the Icon, we sped up the servos a lot, so it's really quick and nimble. It flies really good. I did fly it a lot with the 636 and put probably about a good 70 flights on it it wasn't that it was absolute terrible flying wise but you would get 10 15 flights on it and good no uh no tip overs but then you'd get that one time where it would tip over get back down to low head speed and it would take the blades out or it would break a servo gear which luckily i didn't break any servo gears nick the blades up a couple times But I'm an icon person, so I was like, eh, might as well put an icon in it. But it is solid, Time plenty of power. Minute. Great color scheme. Probably my favorite color scheme helicopter. Yeah, it got to be my favorite color scheme helicopter. And it does get moving. timer normal mode land back on our little piece of wood here 
I mean, it, it's solid. Hold mode. And we all know with the 636, tip overs were a massive issue. But with the Icon, tunability, flight performance is great. Four minute timer. As you've seen on my other videos, how I rewired the helicopter, shortened all the servo leads. The DSMX satellite is up here in the uh, in the nose underneath the battery tray. Pop the canopy real quick, just in case you haven't seen my other videos on it. So we have a DSMX satellite right there. Ran it out, little heat shrink to stop the antenna from the carbon from shaving. I have had zero signal issues. It's been fantastic. Again, roaring top. 1300 milliamp 4 s70c lipo other than that stock servo stock frame just vinyl wrap tail boom and micro heli tail blades thank you guys so much for watching take care have a great day